Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. This article is an older article from Yahoo Finance. I will use it as a placeholder. I will leave a link to it in the description so you guys may check it out. So now we have settled in. It's uh, Most of the work should have been completed by now. T-Mobile launches in Sam's Club as exclusive in-club wireless provider. So most of this now is mostly mature. It's, it's settled in. I've spoken with some of the employees at the kiosk here at the local Sam's Club. It's it's corporate. It, it's it's doing great according to, to the ones that I spoke with. They're saying they're they're getting great engagement with the with the foot traffic. They've uh, in the first month they've signed up plenty of new lines, like straight up new lines, like port ins. They they came from Verizon or AT and T. So they've been able to put in work. They're they're also getting a decent amount of upgrades. They didn't give me exact numbers. But they told me it's working. So I'm going to assume that at grand scale, right, in, in the Sam's Clubs where now T-Mobile is in, I'm going to assume at grand scale that it's, it, it's, it's working, right? There's going to be some, of course, that are, that are higher than others. But foot traffic in general at the Sam's Clubs are, you know, always high. It's always quite high foot traffic-wise. So there's lots of opportunity for the reps to capitalize. And there's nothing holding them back. They're not part of the authorized retailer team. They're corporate. They have access to everything. They can they can make sales. They can they can send you devices if they don't have it in stock at the kiosk. They can do it all. I spoke with them for about 30 minutes and so far so good. So like I said, it's all about the presence. They 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 still have a perception gap. But the more people see T-Mobile, right, at Costco's, Sam's Club, more stores because of the Sprint merger, they're, they're going to start eventually thinking like, hey, T-Mobile must be better because I'm seeing them all over the place. And that's what T-Mobile wants to be known for. They want to be known for brand fame. And so far, so good. I mean, they're, they're making all the right moves. It, it used to be AT&T and Sam's Club, and I'll be very honest here. If I was at and I would have not gotten out. I don't know what transpired fully behind the scenes. I think from what I was hearing, at and was, uh, was being charged more, like rent, to be there, and they didn't want to pay it. Or, uh, or they said uh, the, the return on that investment it does not pan out, meaning what they were paying on the rent or what they would have paid um, would have been too much. Like the, They're saying they're, they're not getting enough traffic of new lines from the sam's club to make it worthwhile t-mobile decided hey we're just gonna do it maybe they're gonna you know test it out i don't know how long the the contract is for but from what they're telling me and 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 that's only one sam's club so take that with a grain of salt take it for what it's worth they're seeing lots of customers that are interested right that they can speak with because of the foot traffic some of them, they convert. Some of them, they don't. Some of them come back because they, they, they shop at Sam's Club, you know, once or twice a week, maybe once a month, whatever. Some of them do come back and then they convert them on the second try. So it's good. Nonetheless, T-Mobile's pushing the brand. They're trying to make it as best as it, it can possibly be. And now that they're more confident in the network than ever, they're trying to be everywhere. They want to be team. They want T-Mobile to be any and everywhere that there that there is a possibility. Like Formula One, the T-Mobile Arena in Vegas. Um, they have a T-Mobile venue in Kansas City now. They're in Sam's Club. They're in they're in a good amount of Costco's. They have more stores. Period. They're bringing more retail distribution in rural. So that's going to be that's going to be interesting to to keep track of as T-Mobile continues its rollout. So make sure you guys stay tuned for more. Like, share, subscribe, follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Live. See y'all in the next one. Peace.